and Facebook, what would you do if you suddenly found yourself cut off from everything? That's what happened to Elizabeth Cito. And she's starting having major problems with her cable TV, her internet service, and her phone. Living way out in St. Clair County's Casco Township, she was furious. So she called Bill Spencer and the call for action team. It's early in the morning in Casco Township, and Elizabeth Cito is lovingly grooming her youngest horse, Grace. What is she? In fact, Elizabeth's entire life is about caring for others. You see, she's a mother of three and runs a licensed daycare center called Fun Days. I want to do good, well-rounded adults one day. You know, good at what they do, confident in themselves, and happy. Yes, Elizabeth is all about making other people happy. But for the last five months, she's been absolutely miserable, dealing with a whole range of problems involving... Tropical storm season heating up. Her HD cable TV service. Her telephone service. And her computer internet service. Elizabeth pays Comcast 250 bucks a month for those services. But last April, big problems started popping up. We started out noticing the TV would pixel in and out. If it was windy or raining, we had, you know, poor reception. Noticed our internet would go off and on. Um, phone service started beeping in and out, or I wasn't receiving calls at all. Suddenly, Elizabeth says her HD TV pictures started to pixelize or come apart. Her internet service would drop out. She suffered countless phone dropouts as well and lost calls. And her TV picture would constantly freeze up or disappear altogether. I just wanted to check base with you. So Elizabeth called Comcast to fix the problems. And over a five-month period, Comcast repairmen came to her house 20 times. But the problems remained. After 20 different repair jobs and everything is still screwed up, how are you feeling? I was fed up. I didn't want them in my house. I didn't want my schedule interrupted anymore. That's when Elizabeth called the Call for Action team. We contacted top officials at Comcast, and within just two days, Comcast sent out a supervisor and a whole team of repairmen. We fixed Elizabeth's problems once and for all. I definitely say thanks because they did what I couldn't get done. That Comcast needed a, you know, a bigger foot stomped on them, and you guys did it. Now, we want to make it clear, we are not angry at Comcast. They did not ignore Elizabeth's complaints. Certainly, it was the exact opposite. They came out to her house 20 different times. It's just that the problem was so complex, it took a whole squad of guys to actually eliminate it. We want to thank Comcast for working with us to fix all of Elizabeth's problems. And if you have a problem, call us. Call the Call for Action team at 248-827-3362. Again, 248-827-3362. Call for action. I'm Bill Spencer. All right. Thanks a lot, Bill, as always. Getting into your hotel room.